I have a story of sportsman spirit for you. One that may give you a lesson on teamwork. It is about a Belgian athlete who stepped forward for her country, quite literally. Meet Jolien Bonquo. Under normal circumstances, she is shot put and hammer throw champion. She was at the European Championships in Poland. An outsider event, 100 meter hurdles race was going on, but there was nobody to represent Belgium. Well known hurdlers, Anna Zagre and Zagre and Han Claes were to run in the race, but both of them had to pull out due to injuries. If nobody would participate in the race, Belgium would have been disqualified. And that is when Bonkwo stepped in and took one for the team. Smiling through it all, she carefully attempted each hurdle. 13 seconds into the race, Spanish sprinter Teresa had already crossed the finish line. But did that stop Bonkwo from going on? It did not. 19 seconds later, without knocking any of the hurdles down, the 29-year-old athlete finished the race. She was applauded by the audience and congratulated by her rivals. You see, points are awarded for every competitor and event at the European Championships. So not only did she save Belgium from disqualification, she also added two points to her country's tally by competing. Now, these points should not be taken lightly. They could, in fact, make all the difference as the bottom three countries will be relegated from Division 1. Bongfo may not have won the race, but she did win the hearts of netizens. It's true that sports persons and athletes face intense competition, but some do not let it get the best of them. Over the years, in fact, there have been multiple such instances when team spirit has proven to be more important than winning. You know, when athletes have warmed the hearts of the audiences with their kindness and their humanity. In the 2020 Tokyo Olympics, American Asiya Jouet was in lead in the men's uh, 800 meters race. He was set to finish in the top two in his heat. But unfortunately, Botswana's Nigel Amos accidentally tripped Jouet from behind. The two runners collapsed on the track, but instead of getting to an argument, Jouet displayed remarkable sportsman spirit. He got up and helped Amos to his feet. Amos apologized for the mistake. Jouet put his arm around him and the two finished the race together. However, Amos let Jouet finish one step ahead of him. And during the same Olympics in the event of high jump, the top two contenders, Motaz Essa Barshim of Qatar and Gonmarco Tamberi of Italy were stuck in a loop. Round after round, the two star athletes simply could not outdo one another and they ended up being tied. The next step was a jump off to see who could simply outlast the other. But that is when things took a turn, one that quickly became a symbol of gamesmanship. The reigning world champion, Barshim, asked, can we have two golds? And the official replied, it is possible, yes. And that was all the athletes needed to hear. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the updates on the move.